At the time of the incident, we don't know the state in mind of the person that committed the double murder. And it is essential that we get a medical examination on that person before police proceed to charge him on murder. Why? Because if we don't, and it goes to court, it will raise the defense of insanity. What does police have to prove that he was of stable mind when he did that? That's why we were calling for that report, and we made arrangement with uh, medical officers at uh, uh, Three Mile. For a week, we wrote to them, waited. They turned up, met with us, but never underwent that process. But now, as the time goes on, the person could have recovered, or it's, it would be very hard to ascertain whether at that time he committed, he was of stable mind. So that is something that we will leave to the court.